Well, hello everyone. We are Pandora Bots. Thank you for choosing us and warm welcome to your second tutorial in chatbot development with Pandora Bots API. In this tutorial, we are going to integrate our John chatbot with any of the website. For the sample, I'm going to integrate it with the local browser. So we can go to our bot and then let's hit on deploy bot. So as soon as you go premium, uh, Pandora Boss chat widget integration is uh, made available so you can hit on add and you get a pop-up uh, you can customize your bot here I'm going for the title I'm going to make my title as John and for the subtitle uh, I'm going to change it to something like it works uh, initial bot message would be a bot message that would pop up when you hit on the chat widget for the first time for the placeholder text as you can see it's going to be something over here uh, i'm going to uh, keep initial bot message and placeholder text as a default for the, for the bot avatar i'm going to use a very special link of the wolf and i'm going to copy a link and i'm going to press it over here if you want this link i'm going to put it in the description so uh, as you can see it immediately updated it for the theme i'm going to update it to some better one i'm going to keep it cyan and it looks good once you are done we can hit on code it would generate a code snippet for you well before that let me explain what the referral filters are suppose you own xyz.com and what you want is you want all the message interaction the message request via that platform if you get some abc.com uh, it should block it for you then what you can do is you can set referrer filters to xyz.com it is really good and handy features to maintain your account privacy and the message flow so uh, for this tutorial i'm not gonna send uh, save any of the referrer filters but you can again uh, use it as per your own convenience i'm going to hit on copy button to copy the snippet and uh, what you can do is you can open any of the uh, uh, text editor i'm going to go into notepad and let's paste it over here I'm gonna save the file. I'm going to save it as test in the desktop. I'm going to name my file as john.html and make it all files. And I'm going to keep my encoding as UTF-8. I'm going to hit the save file button. Uh, before we um, integrate it, uh, let me also tell you that this snippet is a JavaScript snippet. So in case if you are trying to integrate your bot with some, uh, suppose your blog site, then uh, it it is mandatory that your bot uh, a blog site should support uh, embedded JavaScript integration. So make sure your blog site supports that. And let's see, uh, I got my file here. I'm going to open a new tab and I'm going to drop it over here. As soon as you do that, you'll get your chat widget here. As you can see at the background, it's blank, um, but in practice, it's going to be a real website. So why chat widget integration is important. So suppose if you own a website or a working site and instead of frequently asked question, what if uh, we can have it as a bot and the bot would uh, reply uh, as per the customer types in the input, which would be really handy and so cool. Uh, so again, if you are a customer based service and you want to integrate it uh, and entertain your uh, potential customer, then again, chat widget is a good functionality. So suppose you hit on the uh, icon, uh, it would generate the first pop up message. Again, this is a great feature uh, and this is going to be a short tutorial. I'm going to wrap it up here. But if you guys are facing any difficulty uh, integrating your chat widget with any of the websites, feel free to mail us. You can again po uh, put a comment uh, down here. But thank you guys for watching. Keep liking, keep commenting, keep sharing. Above all, keep loving Pandora Bots.